<gasps> Wendy's! Thank you. <laughs> Wendy's fries are the best fries. Hey everyone, it's Brittany. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a haul. This is going to be a cruelty-free makeup and beauty haul. I bought so much stuff recently, especially during the Sephora VIB sales. I also received a lot of PR packages and I went to a few events. So I do have a decent amount of things to show you. I feel like this might actually be the most that I've ever shown in a makeup haul before. I've only used like maybe one or two of the products already because I was just like really excited to use it, but pretty much everything has been saved for this video. So I'm really excited to be filming it so I can actually start using all of this stuff because it's really awesome. And if you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe. I do beauty videos that are all cruelty free as well as some fashion videos, lifestyle videos, things like that. So if you're interested, definitely subscribe and let's go ahead and get started with this beauty haul. I'm gonna go ahead and start off with Sephora. I did purchase a lot of these things in store and online during the VIB sale. So the first thing I got is from a brand called Herbivore and I have heard a lot about this brand, really wanted to try out some things. So I decided to get one of their like gift sets. This is called the Self Love Bath and Body Ritual Kit. It has the Coco Rose Body Polish, the Rose Quartz Illuminating Body Oil, which I was really interested in, as well as the Coconut Milk Bath Soak. I love anything that makes your skin look really shimmery, especially in the summer or if you're showing your arms, like if you're going to an event or something. So I'm really excited to use this. I also got another kit from Herbivore. This is the Mini Facial Oil Trio. I have wanted to try out their facial oils for a while, but they're actually quite expensive, so I figured this would be the best bet. This one one has the Lapis Balancing Face Oil, Orchid Weightless Hydration Face Oil, and the Phoenix Deep Renewal Face Oil. That was the one that I was originally interested in. They have really great reviews, so I'm very excited to try this out too. I'm always looking for new moisturizers and eye creams and things like that to try, so I saw this cute holiday version of the It Cosmetics Secret Sauce. This has really great reviews as well, and it's actually a confetti popper, which... Should I open it on camera now? No, that's gonna make a mess. So I won't open it, but it is actually a really good moisturizer according to the reviews online. And yeah, I hope I like it. <laughs> I totally forgot that I bought this. This is the Drunk Elephant De Bronzy Anti-Pollution Sunshine Serum. I don't usually like to tan my face, or if I do, I won't continue to tan it. So I like to have something that'll just bronze up your skin. Just looks like that. And it's really shimmery and bronzy and beautiful. I decided to pick this one up in store. This is the Fenty Beauty Matchstick Trio. It's Conceal, Contour, and Highlight. And I actually got this because I really wanted mocha for contouring, but they didn't have that one in stock, and I just decided to get the one that has three things. This is the full size of the products as well. Um, the actual color that I got is medium 200. They have a different, like a few different sets of the trios, but this looks really pretty. I don't know if I'll be able to use it as a highlight or if it'll be more like a blush topper, but it's really pretty. This mocha color is actually going to be really nice for like bronzing up my skin and kind of contouring. And this one has the shade bamboo in here. This could actually be used as like a foundation for me. I I really like how these blend out. It's very, very nice. I got this Milk Makeup Stick. It's the blur stick, but it's the luminous one. I do actually really like the blur stick. I only have a mini size of it and it's kind of old, but I wanted to get the one that is luminous because I do really like my skin to have that like glow underneath everything. It's just like the regular blur stick, I think, but it has a little bit of shimmer in it. Nothing too over the top. It's very smooth, easy to blend out. So I think I'm really gonna like this one had lipstick on my teeth. I also got one of the Milk Makeup Concealers. This is supposed to be a really hydrating concealer, so I hope that I like it. I got it more so for underneath my eyes. I haven't found a whole lot that I really like, so I just kind of like testing it out. And if I don't like this one, I can always return it. The last thing I got from Sephora was in the little mini section before you check out. This is from Supergoop. It's the Defense Refresh Setting Mist Broad Spectrum Sunscreen SPF 50. This is to spray over top of your makeup or just to refresh it or as a facial SPF spray. I thought it was really nice, especially if your foundation or something doesn't have SPF in it and you just wanna add a little bit more protection to whatever you have on your face. 
thought this would be a good idea to have. I recently got a PR package from Pure Cosmetics. They do sell Pure Cosmetics at Ulta. This is the Pure Love Your Selfie 3. It's a new eyeshadow palette, but it also has like a blush and bronzer and a highlighter in it. And the packaging is so cute. It has like confetti inside and they have some really beautiful colors as well as like some glitter eyeshadows too. So this would actually be really nice for like holidays or you know, New Year's coming up. This one also comes with a mini fully charged mascara. This is one of my favorite mascaras that I've ever tried too. They also sent me their Sparkle and Shine Bright Highlighter Palette, which has the same kind of confetti packaging, but it also comes with a mini fan brush, which I think is really great. Look at how cute this is. It comes with three different shades. They all look really pretty. They're very creamy. I've definitely tested them out already, so I do like these. Urban Decay recently sent me some more of their Vice lipsticks. I love their lipsticks. I'm wearing one of them. I think it's called 1993 underneath some lip gloss right now, but these are all red-based lipsticks. We've got a ton of different ones to choose from. Honestly, they have like the best selection of lipstick colors. You could find anything you wanted from them. Maybe I'll do a Christmas look with one of these lipsticks. I'm trying to go through these quickly. I hope I am because I don't want to waste too much time. So the next things that I got were from Charlotte Tilbury. I really wanted to get the Wonder Light or the Light Wonder Foundation for so long, but it was always sold out in my shade. So I actually went to an event recently and they gifted it to me. I cannot wait to use this. I've already tested it on my hand just to see like what the color is like and the texture and already I really like it and they also gave one of the Charlotte Tilbury matte revolution luminous modern matte lipsticks this is in the shade bond girl and it is beautiful I love the packaging for Charlotte Tilbury and this is what the actual shade looks like honestly it matches my sweater that I'm wearing pretty much perfectly <laughs> everything about this makeup brand just looks so luxurious next I want to show you everything that I got from Ulta first is this Smashbox always on mini matte duo it's the eight hour power pout and it comes with two different colors I believe this was only ten dollars so this would also make a really great stocking stuffer this year they have them in the shade driver's seat which is more of like a corally color and spoiler alert which is like a purpley mauve shade from essence I also got the make me glow liquid bronzer but I do feel like this is more of a golden highlight I would not consider this a bronzer and the other thing I got from essence I think is new it's one of their new lip products it's called water kiss it's a glossy lip color it kind of gives you like a glossy stained look on your lips I got mine in the shade aqua chic it also matches my sweater pretty much perfectly at least in real life I recently discovered that the Ulta brand makeup at Ulta is actually cruelty free so I wanted to try out some different things from there most of them were lip products so the lip products that I got one of them is a matte lip cream it's in the shade brilliant it's like a red orange I got another Ulta Beauty matte lip cream this is in the shade courageous it's also very similar to my sweater color. I got a lip gloss stain in the color crown. It's just a more neutral pink. It's pretty low key. And the last lip color I got is the Radiant Shine lipstick in the shade Innocent. I did get some face products from Ulta as well from their actual like Ulta Beauty collection. This is the Flushed Blush Natural Finish in the shade Pink Smoke. The other face product I got from the Ulta Beauty collection is the Face Sculpting Color Stick. They have like blushes, bronzers, highlighters. This one is a highlighter and it's in the shade Highlight. I really like stick highlighters. It's just super easy to apply. It's a really pretty color and it just gives that natural glow. And the last two things I got from the Ulta Beauty collection are eyeshadows. This is the Glitter Eye Top Coat, and this is the Lustrous Foil Eyeshadow. And I got this one in the shade Midnight Leaf. This is such a fun color. I cannot wait to use this. I'm kind of thinking I'll do something for New Year's Eve with this. And then the Glitter Eye Top Coat looks just like this. I got this one in the shade Fairy Princess. This also has a very similar texture to the Stila Foil Eyeshadows. That is what Fairy Princess looks like. Might as well swatch Midnight Leaf too. Like, look at that. They have a bunch of other shades too. Next, I want to show you some things that I 
got at the body shop. I got to go into their store for an event and they let me pick out a bunch of things and I really love their holiday collection. This candle smells exactly like a Christmas tree, but it also has like a warm, sweet scent to it. So these types of candles, I love burning around Christmas and especially in my room because the only Christmas tree I have in my room is that one right there. But oh my God, it smells amazing. This would also be such a nice gift for someone too, especially if you're doing like a white elephant gift or just like stocking stuffers or something like that or literally for anybody because it smells so good. I also got a body wash from the body shop and this one is called Tahitian Tiare. I hope I said that right, but it's the Spa of the World collection. So this is the Aloe Soothing Eye and Lip Contour Care. This is more so for sensitive skin. I don't think I've tried this one yet on my eyes, but I'm really excited to. This is the Body Shop Drops of Youth Youth Bouncy Eye Mask. This one is really cool because you could use it as just a regular eye cream, but you can also use it as a mask, which is what I liked to do. And it made my skin feel so much nicer and so much more like relieved because I usually get really sore dry skin around my eyes it's really annoying and not cute like a really cool like jelly texture I have two more things from the body shop one is from their holiday collection these are their mini bath bombs and they are so cute they smell really great and they're also really good as a stocking stuffer I got mine in the scent candied plum which was literally one of the nicest things I've ever smelt. The size is perfect too. You can just pick up a bunch of these and they're really easy just to like throw in a stocking. The last thing I got is a night mask. This is the Tea Tree Anti-Imperfection Night Mask. I really love the face mask from the body shop and anything with tea tree in it, I really like too. It looks like flubber. So yeah, this is really nice. I actually did really like using this one as well. You just don't wanna use it like every single day. Okay, going back to actual makeup, I have this really incredible package that I got from Too Faced. They sent it in this really cool bag. The company that made this bag is called Stony Clover. Inside, they sent a ton of stuff from their new Pretty Rich collection. So of course they sent the Pretty Rich Diamond Light Eyeshadow Palette. Everything in this line is basically a jewelry box with like the makeup inside. So here's what the eyeshadow palette looks like. Those shades are so beautiful. I cannot wait to play around with this. Maybe I'll also do like a Christmas look using this. They have three highlighters in this collection and they all look like little ring boxes. Like how cute is that? I love it. They have a radiance boosting glitter face mask. It's called Glow Job and the actual mask is just full of glitter. I am so excited to use that. And they also have these rich and dazzling lip glosses. They sent a bunch of shades. I'm gonna show you which one is my favorite. I love the one called All the Stars. It's so beautiful. I wanna wear this like every day. IGK recently sent me the Crybaby Anti-Frizz Smoothing Serum. I have not tried this yet, but I love everything that I've ever tried from IGK. I love the Stila Shimmer and Glow eyeshadows or the glitter and glow eyeshadows. This one is a set of minis and I love that too because realistically most people don't wear glitter every single day so it might be kind of hard to go through one but this is a nice way to get a bunch of different shades if you like to play around with makeup. They of course also have a mini set which again would be perfect as a stocking stuffer. This is the little big shot set. It has the stay all day waterproof liquid eyeliner which I love. I honestly think it's my favorite and the mascara mini is the huge extreme lash mascara which I have used before in the full size and I really like it. And my very last thing I have to show you is from Lush. This is one of their holiday gift sets. They actually sent this to me. They are amazing. I love their holiday sets. I usually get them for people for Christmas. If you are looking for a gift to give someone who is more of a shower person, then I would definitely suggest getting the Secret Garden one. This one has the Sleepy Shower Gel, Rose Jam Shower Gel, Rose Argan Body Conditioner, Sleepy Body Lotion, Scrubby Body Butter, and the golden pear soap. So there aren't any bath bombs in here. Some of their gift sets would be like all bath bombs, which is amazing if you were getting it for a person who likes to take baths, but this is perfect for literally anybody. And that is everything that I have to show you. I have no idea how long this video ended up being. I hope you guys stuck around till the very end. If you did, thank you so much. I love you. Hopefully this video also gave you some ideas for like new products to get for people for Christmas. If there's somebody in your life 
products that love skincare or makeup. So yeah, I hope you're having an amazing day. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.